do for the nations we need to pray for peace we need to pray for peace and we need to pray against pestilence famine and diseases pestilence famine and diseases now watch the news this year you will hear of the outbreak of a disease you know recently we've been used to biological chemical uh, weapons released as diseases and what i mean is diseases that were created in a lab and dispatched do you know that good but i saw a disease that broke out from an animal this year the World Health Organization has declared a global public health emergency following an outbreak of a new strain of the mpox virus in Africa. The virus, formerly known as monkeypox, can be passed on through close contact and causes flu-like symptoms and lesions on the body and can be deadly. It's now been detected in at least 13 African countries, but one country has been hit particularly hard, the Democratic Republic of Congo. MPOX is surging across Africa. And this is ground zero. Thousands of cases have been reported in the Democratic Republic of Congo as a new outbreak grips the country. It's already claimed at least 450 lives, most of them children, and it's showing no sign of slowing down. The detection and rapid spread of a new clade of MPOX in Eastern DRC, its detection in neighboring countries that had not previously reported MPOX, and the potential for further spread within Africa and beyond is very worrying. In addition to other outbreaks of other clades of MPOX in other parts of Africa, it's clear that a coordinated international response is essential to stop these outbreaks and save lives. Formerly known as monkeypox, mpox spreads through close contact, including sex, causing flu-like symptoms and painful pus-filled lesions. But this new strain is proving more infectious and even more deadly. And experts fear the growing outbreak in Africa could just be the tip of the iceberg. We believe that uh, it's already uh, a risk uh, for international spread and of course uh, there is also the chance that it could spread beyond Africa to other regions of the world. You will see it on the news. I don't know if it's a virus or whatever, but it will be from an animal. So we need to pray against pestilence. I, I, I spoke about diseases in, in December at the prophetic school and also at um, that nurse meeting good go on the news uh where which what part is it south asia or where europe yes europe and south asia i mentioned i think we'll get that video out so they see it's already there i spoke about war and insecurity and insurgency and i spoke about southern america and some parts of africa and in the news go and search on google now there are uprisings in Ecuador. Ecuador is a nation in South America. There is hell is on the rampage this year. We need to pray for peace by all means. By all means. I'm talking about governments will come to a point where they are their wits end. They failed. What we don't know what to do about this situation again. It's only the Prince of Peace that will give us peace. But here's a good news for somebody. As long as you remain in the will of God and you keep dwelling in the house of God, no evil shall befall you. Yeah. Now, let's continue. So we need to pray for peace among nations, especially in Nigeria, and pray against pestilence, famine, famine, and disease. There's an African nation that will be hit with serious famine. Let's pray that God will preserve life because I saw children dying. You see all these things on the news. Just write it. And it's, it's online. So it will be there. 
you will see it on the news i pray that god will protect the christians in those nations now for the church just pray against death are you hearing what i'm saying i tell you this i'm i'm telling you as i'm hearing from god okay and let's see what god will do but that election oh kai from the way i see it trump has to win huh uh, among the two of them is the only one that can intercept god can use to intercept what is coming globally so it's not even because of america it's because of the whole world because there's a plan of the enemy to shut down again i don't know how you interpret shut down you get it but there's a plan to shut down 